what is going on everybody it is a hot one here in ohio today and evelyn and i we are on the way to the range it's hot but we still gotta get that practice in send a couple arrows down range uh that way we make sure it's a uh, productive and good day wanted to uh take a quick minute and if you guys follow this channel you know from time to time i do product reviews i wanted to give you guys um some feedback on the muddy manifest trail camera uh, that i've been running here lately and um give me my thoughts on it so let's open this disaster here and here she is the uh, muddy cell cam all right so here is my muddy manifest um, trail camera so i purchased this thing back in january of 2021 so right about seven months ago and i've been running it uh in hawking hills at my family's property um at the top of one of our hills there's a spot it's just it's hard to constantly be checking cameras in there so i wanted to invest in a cell camera um and one that's not too pricey so just in general, I never really buy expensive cameras. And the main reason is theft. I've had a lot of cameras stolen. So about the past year, year and a half, I've been buying a lot of Muddy's cameras. Um, mainly they're, you, you know, traditional non-cellular cameras. But because of the location, I wanted to try cell cameras. So I bought the Manifest. Um, for the price, pretty present, pleasantly surprised, honestly. Uh, it doesn't do video or anything like that. Um, but it was giving me pictures you know good feedback of what was going on, on top of the hill um and what really impressed me was the battery life it ran a you know six months a little over six months before the batteries finally went out but what happened is i did go up there to change the batteries and it said it needed to do a camera update so pulled out my cell phone which is what you know i'm running the muddy stealth cam app um through my cell phone pulled out my phone to uh update the camera and everything you know, it just went blank. So I followed um, step by step how it how it wants you to update the camera. So everything went blank. I ended up just pulling the camera, couldn't get it to turn back on. And uh, you know, the next day I contacted Muddy, and they did not seem shocked at all. Like it seemed like this is a pretty common occurrence here because they didn't even bat an eye um, and said that it's a dead camera. So I don't know exactly what a dead camera is, but. You know apparently it doesn't work and there's it's not going to ever work again because um they they told me to just pitch it and they'll send me a new one so obviously i'm hanging on to it um until i receive the new one it's it's probably been coming up on two weeks so i should have it here shortly um but just want to give everybody kind of my thoughts um you know gave pretty good images especially for the price point again because of theft issues i'm not trying to spend you know two three hundred dollars on a camera i've just had way too many stolen so um you know it was working well but they don't seem to have the best reviews right now i don't know if you know this is happening to other people but the way muddy acted without hesitation is this is a pretty common um, issue with these manifests when you go to update they become a dead camera and i mean it just turned into a rock it didn't work i changed out the batteries two different times nothing helped uh changed out sd cards you know thought it was maybe something i did um but batteries new sd cards still nothing from the camera so my thoughts um i'll, I'll try to keep you guys updated um you know obviously not not a good thing initially but i am happy that they're sending me a new camera so you know things happen i get that all i can ask is a company stand behind their products and if something does happen correct it and you know replace it especially you know things not you know was six months old when it when we had the issue so uh, my thoughts um, if you guys want to see more product reviews hunting shooting trick shots anything bow hunting hit that subscribe button for me and uh, i'll see you next time